I'm curious if there's a if there are other industries where either they're ahead or they're thinking differently that you mm. think yourself and the tech industry can learn from. There's many people on the design team that are constantly thinking in creative ways. We have a uh, color materials and finish component and they're a core to the materials we use and the references that they bring to the table often transform how we look at things. We do a lot of uh, soft material. I think a lot of people think, well, you might be talking like a travel bag or something like that. But we have a lot of products, uh, whether it be in our poly organization or our PC organization that uses speaker cloth. We look to the fashion industry, uh, the fabrics that are being used, where people have transformed. And with those companies, we understood you can take PET and you can weave it. And what we did though, is we took materials that we brought in from a waste stream, spun it into thread, and then turned it into acoustic fabric. That wasn't easy to do. We have some um, fun with it because it's very exciting to use new materials that are different and apply them in different ways. And it's a, it's a lovely story when you sit down with your customers it's a little bit of guess what that's made of. And in our all-in-ones, we use coffee. The immediate thing is when they see it, they want to scratch and sniff. And it's not a sniff. scratch and sniff game. <laughs> One thing that I, I think always happens is you have to help the end user, the customer understand that their material that they have in their product is special. 